Hey there, I am Josh Short from Edit Video Faster. This tutorial is on how to add an alpha channel in Adobe Photoshop. If you're new to my tutorials, welcome. I come out with a new tutorial every week. Most tutorials are in Avid Media Composer or After Effects. This is my first dive into Photoshop and I'm sure it won't be my last. If there's anything you want to see in the future or anything from this video that you want me to go more in depth on, let me know in the comments. All right, on with the tutorial. I already have Photoshop open with this sample picture of a laptop. What I want to do is add an alpha channel to it so that the parts in white become transparent when I import it into another Photoshop document, Media Composer, After Effects, or any other software. This image has a pretty clean key on it already, uh, and I don't really want to get into the nitty gritty bits of keying. Um, I'll save that for another tutorial. So uh, simply, I'm going to select my layer and then turn on the magic wand tool by hitting the letter W. Uh, select the background and hit delete. And then do it again for the screen. Go over to the layer and hold down command if you're on a Mac or control if you're on a PC and click on the layers icon. This selects all the boundaries of that layer. Go ahead and select the channels panel. And at the bottom of the panel, go ahead and click the little rectangle with the dot in the middle. Uh, and that saves the selection as a channel. And there's our alpha channel. I'm going to delete this channel and show you one more thing. Let's say you have multiple layers that you want to uh, select to create your alpha channel. Go ahead and command or control click the first layer again and then hold down shift while holding command or control and click the second layer. This adds the second layer to your selection. You can do this with as many layers as you want. Then go back to channels and click the same rectangle with a circle in it. There's our alpha channel. Next, we need to make sure that we save the alpha channel on the PSD. I'm going to hit command or control shift S to open save as. Then when we save, uh, make sure to check the box next to alpha channels. And that's it. I hope you found this tutorial on adding an alpha channel in Photoshop helpful. Make sure to head on over to editvideofaster.com to check out what's going on over there. I come out with a new post every week. This week's post was on preparing to go on vacation as a video editor. Go check it out. Thanks as always for watching. If you know someone who could benefit from this tutorial, do him or her a favor and send it over to them. Lastly, I have a question for you. What's the first version of Photoshop you've ever used? I'll leave my answer in the comments. You do the same. Alright, see you over at the site and back here for another tutorial next week.